Hello, I've been to Poundland again. Didn't get that from Poundland. I don't know where I got that from. I really don't know why I've got that one. Um, maybe it should be downstairs in the dark room. I got one of these, uh, and I'm working with a tripod. I'll try wobbling without knocking everything over. Um, uh, I've got a special Poundland scissors, snippety snip. Let's see if we can get in there. These Poundland scissors, they come in packs of three when they've got them. And they're, they're remarkably good value. They do seem to be very, very good scissors. The problem is I keep losing them. Um, there we go. Let's remove a bit of cardboard. What does this say? I can't see. Always switch on the light bulb. The lamp housing could be hot. It's an LED. I'd be a lot happier if it wasn't going to burn me. Um, yeah, really hot LED is never a good thing. Um, the lamp will cool down. Oh, protect from splashes of liquid. We might keep the blood out of the way then. Uh, do not fit a high wattage bulb and recommended for your fitting. This is three watt. I think we'll be all right. Please dispose of used bulb carefully. I'm that means do not throw it at people. No parts are replaceable and lamps should not be dismantled. <laughs> okay. Uh, <laughs> and then it just says stuff in Spanish. Uh, it's A plus energy rating. Ah, okay. Right. Enough of that nonsense. I suppose first thing we ought to do is see if it works. Oh, hang on, this one isn't screw, is it? So I can just do that straight. It works. Actually, it's it, it's quite bright. I'm quite impressed with that. Oh well. If it comes apart easily, it comes apart easily. If it doesn't, I'll just go and be impressed with its awesome brightness. That is plastic. This is sort of his glassy shatter. Then you get to see real blood. Pry bar. This might take longer than expected. Let's see if we can see. I think it's being glued together. Obviously, when they make them, they, they then watch and they see that Big Clive gets into them and they, oh, we can't have that. And then they start gluing them. Can we watch for the blood? Okay, come back in some time. Okay, as you can see, it's now some time later, and um, I can't get into it. Well, I can, but only by using quite a lot of the force, uh, which I don't want to do, because I, I want to use it. So that's slightly disappointing. So there's uh, three groups of three little surface mount LEDs. Should we guess what's in there? Oops, that's the first time I've banged my head on there today, isn't it? Uh, right, give us some time to go and get some paper. Yes, you'll have to. Some more time later. Oh, I've got a tatty bit of paper because it didn't rip out my pad properly. Uh, uh, um, I'm guessing it's got three groups of three LEDs. Uh, what's a volt drop across each LED going to be? If it says it's three watt, that means each group of three, that means each one of those is a third of a watt. Which I kind of think 
is unlikely. <laughs> oh, it, it might be. We'll put it on a power meter in a minute if we can find that. No, that'll be another break. Okay. Um, I'm gonna, let's, let's, let's hazard a guess. Let's say we've got phase supply there. Let's lay bets it does something like that through a capacitor. Bridge rep. Um, that's probably going to be another resistor there. And then onto the LEDs. Whichever way around I drew them. Da, 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 da. And to, to that one. In, in some form. Um, we'll wave a finger at it in a minute. I've been very lucky with the LED light bulbs that I've bought so far in that they've all been fairly flicker free and that one appears to be the same which means there's probably something with capacitor across there that might be the wrong way around um, if we're really lucky there'll be a capacitor uh, there'll be a resistor there and another one there if we're really lucky but we don't know. I'll put a link in to the Big Clive video. I'll go and find the power meter. Back again. I don't know if you can see that. It says two and a half watt. What's that just falling on the floor? That's all right, it's a solder. Uh, that's a different lamp, so we're going to turn that one up. We're going to put in the oh, it's already in there, and we're going to try this one. I'll get that out of the way so it doesn't fall on me. Um, this is where I find I can't reach to turn out the other one. I can't. Oh, wait. hang on. There we go. And that's 3.4 watt. That's good, because that other one, which I've just turned off to test this one, was supposed to be 5 watt. And this is 3.4 and only supposed to be 3. Uh, function, let's see what else we can look. Kilowatt hours, won't bother with that. Uh, it's 243 volts. Ooh, 36 milliamps. Uh, what's that, is that power factor? Power factor of 0.41. What was it? Two, four, three times 0 0.036. That gives us 8.748 watt times power factor 0 0.41 3.58 that's not bad uh watts low to oh right high 3.4 oh this has obviously reset itself at some point 8.4 i'm gonna buy some more of these uh they're obviously better than the chinese ones and they're cheaper and you don't have to wait 47 years for them to come from china that is a success. I'm happy now. So we can all go home. I, I hate to think what I'm going to do next. I'm looking for stuff to rip to bits or to use constructively. Um, but we'll find something. Bye. <laughs>